Hey, it's Justin with Seaboard Marine. In this video, we're going to wrap up a few things on the Restless, the exhaust, the kill cooler, a few other things, and then test fire the engine. Justin and Frank here with Seaboard Marine. In this video, we're going to show you how we did the kill cooler, and uh, Frank's working on something cool here. What are you working on? Working on the return for to go from the engine to the kill cooler. Okay. And we're we'll using some galvanized plumbing. And we're going to connect it, everything with hoses. So we're going to go from right here. We're going to get up probably this way, with a 90 or whatever will work. Okay. And then we're going to put this on this corner here. It's kind of like that, underneath this lip. Connect, connected with a hose. Connected with a hose. And then the same thing over there in that corner. But it's going to point down like this. Okay. Like that, yeah. Towards right. that, fitting over there. Cool. Kinda so you're like just right basically here. doing plumbing right now. That's it. Yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. Cool. And so you're going to take each one of these on the lathe and turn them into a nice barb? Mm hmm Yeah. Make it up the barbs here. Okay. All right. So we got these made up with uh, hose barbs ready to uh, assemble all this together. Okay. So we got these. Um, we took these and cut them in a 13 degree angle and twisted them to make a 26 inclusive. Give me a 90. A 90? Yeah. Uh, okay, here's a 90. I can hold that. Oh, there you go. All right. That looks pretty good. That looks pretty good, huh? Well, trigonometry never fails, huh? Five. Five. Yep. All right, got all these painted. Looking good. All right, so here's the the build side of our um, keel cooling system. So there's the through hole. First thing it hits is a heat exchanger for the gear, the gear cooler. And then um, another heat exchanger for the hydraulics. Then we got some plumbing here. It's routed up to the after cooler. Then follow it along. It goes around to the, to the pump, the coolant pump. Comes out thermostat and goes around here okay, then yeah. around the combing back down to the keel cooling so that's our keel cooling system all right working on the exhaust here for the restless so we got a flange and a couple elbows and we've already kind of tacked up a few things we're kind of trying to route it down and under the combing here and meet up with this is total is a dry exhaust so it goes up and out the top so far we made this flange to b that bolts onto the old exhaust. Turn this on the lathe and then drill these, this pattern to match. All right, we got the exhaust for the Restless. There's a total dry stack, right? So we got wrinkle belly for a little bit of movement. All right, we got the exhaust system for the Restless. Man, with that uh, cooling plumbing on the combing, it's tight in there, huh? Le pongo el tornillo. Yep. Oh. Better fit. All right, we got the music in the background. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you had to reduce down right there at the uh, flange. Yeah. Here's the shaft for the restless. It's been. Uh, we ordered it with a coupler. Uh, and it's a tapered tapered fit shaft to the coupler tapered and keyed we're ready to bolt on to the transmission so we're gonna roll it we always roll our shafts and make sure that they're running true okay putting the shaft in what do you got there a little Spe dawn special juice special juice dawn and water cool <laughs> Kool-Aid. Kool-Aid. Don't drink it. It's all about feeling where it wants to go, right? Yeah. Keep it on center. Oh, there it goes. Perfect. There you go. So there's a, a stainless steel log. It's like a three inch pipe or three and a half inch pipe. And there's that log and that connects to the uh, packing gland or to the um, bearing. We made a custom bearing, right? 
Correct. And then the packing gland's gonna go right there on a the hose. All right, prop for the restless going on, huh? Yeah. Nice. Big nut. Big nut first, little nut first. Comment, comment down below. <laughs> the comment section. Yes. <laughs> Big nut first or little nut first? Yes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's good, right? Fired it up, huh? Battery connection, huh? Yeah. Now, here's, the here's the priming pump. You put a charger on there just to make sure she had plenty of cranking, yeah. cranking amps. Yep. So without being in the water, since it's keel cold, you can't run very long, huh? Oh yeah, I could run minutes for sure. Take probably take an hour. It hot. You ready? Oh, uh, tell me when. Okay, guys. Let me get the Allen wrench and open up the filter thing. Okay, and then there's the next. Oh yeah. The next, the next Crack the filter right yeah, here. I don't. I got it. So this is how we get the fuel filter. Full of fuel. There we go. Whoa. Yep. Yeah. No, it's Maybe. still, still some air. Air. So you crack this um, plug here, and then turn on the in, the key to the on position, and the priming pump will fill up the filter. And you can see all the air bubbles coming out of there. I don't see much air. Yeah, it's solid fuel now. Okay. Yeah. I don't think it's a problem. Okay, yeah, I, I think. Try it. We can try it again. What do we yeah, got to lose? To start it. Are you ready? Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Got a second, second wheel. Yeah. Turn it right now. Yeah, good. 